I have shown several types of SSD drives with various formats, sizes and storage capacities. And I've already shown aluminium heat sinks for cooling computer chips. But today I'm going to show you a heat sink for an M.2 SSD drive. But first, subscribe to the channel because I post new videos every week. Dissipating heat from electronic devices, especially to cool microchips, is crucial for the fast operation of electronic components. To do this, we use aluminium heat sinks, which are essential for cooling electronic device chips for thermal efficiency. Because when devices operate with too much heat, they can overheat and fail. That's why we use aluminium heat sinks, because it's a material with excellent thermal conductivity. This means that the aluminium can quickly transfer heat from the chip to the aluminium and dissipate to the air, so the microchip becomes less hot, improving its performance. This is the HP919952 heat sink for HP Z4 computers, which is a thermal sink for an SSD M.2-2280, and it's an essential component to ensure the performance of an M.2 SSD. This aluminium heat sink is the ideal size for an SSD with a length of 80 mm, maintaining contact with all the M.2 module and transferring the heat from all the chips to the aluminium block. This thermal heat sink is essential for high performance computers and crucial for lowering the temperature of the SSD. This cooling component is made with three parts the aluminium block that is placed above the M.2 module, the metallic support that fits underneath the module, and the metallic mechanism that holds both parts. It is very easy to mount this cooling component on a M.2 SSD, and it is a fundamental component to ensure the proper functioning of an SSD, to have the best performance from your computer. With SSDs becoming faster and with more microchips, this thermal heat sink is an essential component for professional and high performance computers. The aluminium heat sink is compatible with any M.2-2280 SSD module with a length of 80 mm, but there are many other modules of heat sinks for an M.2 SSD, and you should choose the appropriate size of heat sink for your SSD because the more contact surface that the aluminium has with the SSD microchips and the more aluminium volume it has, the more heat will be removed to cool the SSD for maximum efficiency. With these thermal heat sinks, you can use fans. The fan placed on the aluminium heat sink will cool the aluminium faster, and by cooling the aluminium, it will further cool the chip of the electronic component that is cooling. You should also choose the fan size appropriate to the size of the aluminium heat sink. As aluminium, it's easy to mold. Aluminium heat sinks can be manufactured in various sizes and shapes, from very small to very large. And you must choose the appropriate heat sink for the chip you want to cool. In the coming weeks, I will test this device to evaluate thermal temperature to prove the importance of cooling electronic devices and I will show how easy it is to install an SSD with a thermal heat sink in a computer. But now, subscribe to the channel because I post new videos every week.